An update now in the nationwide college admissions scandal. The U.S. Attorney's Office says actress Lori Loughlin and her husband Massimo Giannulli have agreed to plead guilty to conspiracy charges. News 8's Kelly Hessedal joins us live now with these details. Kelly. Yeah, and good morning, Eric. That's right. The high-profile couple has agreed to plead guilty. Now, if a judge approves this plea agreement, it means that the couple could avoid a very long sentence, uh, possibly as long as 20 years, and instead serve just a matter of months. Lori, 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 pay for my tuition, Lori! Actress Lori Lachlan and her fashion designer husband, Massimo Giannulli, will appear in federal court tomorrow to plead guilty to charges they paid $500,000 in bribes to get their two daughters into USC. Under the plea agreement, Lachlan will plead guilty to one count of conspiracy to commit wire and mail fraud, while Giannulli will plead guilty to one count of conspiracy to commit wire and mail fraud and honest services wire and mail fraud. Here's what their sentences will look like if the judge approves it. Lachlan will serve two months in prison, a $150,000 fine, two years of supervised release, and 100 hours of community service. Her husband will serve five months in prison, a $250,000 fine, and two years of supervised release, with 250 hours of community service. This case has been playing out for more than a year. The couple is among the 50 parents charged by federal prosecutors. Elizabeth, do you have any comments to make? Do you have anything to say? Former KFMB TV owner Elizabeth Kimmel was charged as well. And right now, Kimmel is among the parents who have not taken a plea deal yet. So for right now, her case is still set to go to trial. As for Lachlan uh, and her husband, experts say that because of the pandemic, it's possible they could serve their sentence under house arrest or possibly may even be able to delay serving their sentence altogether. Back to you.